Hello and welcome to Versative Pro MPTS Transcoding Part 1. And we're going to log in here, VMS, VMS. First thing we're going to do is add the Ethernet resource. And that is uh, coming in on port 1, TH1. is where you choose your IP address and your port and your protocol and if you have a multicast or a unicast you click the multicast checkbox and if you have an SSM IP you would enter it on the bottom you click analyze and the versative will analyze the stream you've entered to see if it's in the network. <coughs> if there's multiple programs, uh, in this case there is quite a few, it may take a little longer than it would be for a single program. So as you see here I have some MPIC4 programs. Uh, I am going to drag and drop and to the from the left pane to the right pane uh, the right side is the uh, resource name that uh, by default we put the uh, Ethernet IP that it analyzed and um, um, you can change that afterwards you'll see in a moment uh, at this stage it's a drag and drop type of operation uh, where you hold the mouse button, the left mouse button, and you'll see there's an X there telling you that as you're dragging it, it, it it's, it's not a, a, a place where you can drop it. To drop, you release the left mouse button. But you'll see as you bring it over to the resource, it will uh, lock with a check mark, a green check mark, to tell you that this is where you release um, the mouse button. And that's how it's done. So we have our video, audio pad, and a data pad, a splice info pad. Here I'm going to rename. You click the rename button. In this case, I just called it test one. Uh, now I can continue on, and add another resource. Um, so I just name that one, and then I'm going to find the other program. And again, I just drag and drop and drop it into place on test two. I don't need to rename anything, so I'll just add another resource called test three. And here it alternatively you can drag the individual PIDs if you're wanting to only add certain audio PIDs and then you are you click add and you are added to the tree we have test one two and three and this completes this trading view of part one